Okay, so I'm going to show everybody how to trace a shape that you find on the internet for Fusion 360. Let's start with a nice simple shape like the Skyrim logo here. I'm going to copy it, copy image, and it needs to go over into Inkscape. So here in Inkscape, I'm going to paste. So there's our image. Now what I need to do with this is trace it and get rid of that other shape there. So now we have our Skyrim shape. Now I want to save this. This is the part that's different though. Save this for yourself, so I'm going to save it in my OneDrive. And the important thing here is you need to save it as a DXF type of document. That's an old type of document from Autodesk, the company that made Fusion. It's like a 30 years old type of file type. Let's call this Skyrim.DXF. Save. Okay. All of that looks good. Now in Fusion here, I'm going to start a sketch, and in this sketch, what I want to do is insert that DXF. So, sketch plane has been selected, I need to find my file, I put it in my OneDrive, there's Skyrim.DXF. Okay, now it's going to think for a couple seconds, there it is. So now this shape can be extruded, so if I hit OK and finish the sketch on all of this, now this shape can be extruded, I don't know, say 10 millimeters, something like that. And we can see we've made a 3D shape that we've traced from the internet. All right, that's it for this quick video.